Hey there everybody, it's Mike Delisio with another Dice Tower Daily Unboxing. Today we're going to be taking a look at Photo Fish. Coming from Logis Games, two to four players in about 15 minutes. Hey kids, would you like to join us for a very special competition? We are on the lookout for the best underwater photographer. Who will be the first to take the best pictures? But be attentive, because we'll be looking just for some particular shots. This game is perfect for developing attention to detail, improving reaction and response time, and subsequently, eye-hand coordination. Young players can evaluate the results they have achieved themselves without any assistance from the adults, as this puzzle game is simple enough and well adapted for children. All right, so a kid's game. It looks like it was nominated for the Kinderspiel de Jahres of 2020, which is the most prestigious board game award um, around. This would be the kid's version of it. We've got multiple rules. Let's take a look at the English rules here, okay? So it's a 15 minute game. Kids, two to four kids from four years and up, all right? So the game setup is here. You're taking the aquariums out of the box. The goal is to be the first to assemble the longest fish, which no longer fits into the aquarium, all right? The oldest player starts the first round by rolling the dice. The players play the game in separate rounds. Each round has three phases, preparation, taking photos, and evaluation. And in the preparation, they place their aquariums in front of them and put their cameras anywhere inside of the aquarium. Okay, that's cute. Taking photos. When they're ready, the starting player rolls both dice. The rolled out color of the fish indicates what players need to look for in their aquariums before taking their photos. As soon as the dice are rolled, the players quickly move their cameras within the aquarium, trying to be the first to find the picture. And you've got some rules. You can't have it tilted. All right, you can only show water and fish. And it can only show the fish that are in the uh, picture, all right? And then the camera can't be lifted or taken off. As soon as someone finds it, they, he or she shouts, click, and leaves their camera there, all right? Other people continue to do it. Also shout out, click, and then we evaluate. And there's different difficulty levels there too. Very cute idea, okay? Here are our different colored fishies, all right? Not the thickest of cardboard, but I'm not sure that it really needs to be for the purposes of the game. All right. Here are our aquariums, and these are nice and thick. Okay. Double-sided with many colorful fish that can be photographed by these cameras. Okay. We've got our red cameras and our yellow cameras, and it looks like one is smaller than the other, and I imagine that would be perhaps a difficulty here because the bigger cameras, obviously, I would imagine, would be easier than the smaller cameras. So that's a nice little, oops, sorry about bumping the camera there. That's a nice little way to maybe address difficulty level, or maybe you could even have it so that if you had older kids playing with younger kids or adults playing with younger kids, you could have one have the bigger camera and the other have the smaller camera. Here's some two custom wooden dice, which are very cute. Looking for a purple only fish, go! That type of a thing, okay. All right, well, this is a cute idea, and it looks like something that I think a lot of kids might enjoy. That is Photo Fish. Thank you for watching another Dice Tower Daily Unboxing.